Hello Gemini, welcome to a you and them love reading. We're gonna be looking at what's going on in your connection and how you feel about each other. Okay, so let's jump right in. As always, Gemini, this is a general love reading. So it won't resonate with every Gemini watching. You'll know pretty soon if this is your reading. So please take what resonates. All right, so let's get into this for ages, guys. What messages do you have for Gemini? Let's look at what's going on in your connection at this time. Spirit, tell me what's going on for Gemini in love. Okay, we have the Five of Swords. What's going on for Gemini in love? Hmm, and the Four of Coin. So what I'm seeing here is there has been some sort of conflict. It could be verbal conflict, an argument, a situation that wasn't fair to you or that didn't feel fair. Perhaps someone deceived you, Gemini, or it wasn't what you thought it was going to be or they weren't what you thought they were going to be. Um, I feel like whatever happened between you and this person, uh, at least one of you is holding back, keeping to yourself, guarding yourself, protecting yourself. Um, let's see. Tell me more about what happened with the Five of Swords here. Spirit, what is this Five of Swords about? What's going on here? Eight of Swords. I have it with the Five of Swords. Can you get some more clarity, please? What is Five of Swords? Three of Coin. Interesting. I feel like whatever happened was interesting. So the message that I'm, that I'm getting, I'm getting a lot of messages, but one of the messages that I'm getting is almost like whatever happened here, someone's really thinking about it a lot. Um, almost like maybe they got themselves stuck and now they have to figure out a way to come back from what happened. Um, Others of you, I'm getting that this is a situation that someone's thinking a lot about it. They're thinking a lot about it, but they're also kind of like trying to stay busy, not think about it so much, distracting themselves, throwing themselves into work. Can I get one more for this Five of Swords? nine of cups i feel like someone here was um being selfish whatever happened between you and this person they were only really thinking of themselves at the time um i don't know if someone here is trying to work on something where with the three of pentacles and the nine of cups like they want something what's with this nine of cups High Priestess. Yeah, I feel like this was somebody that maybe deceived you or kept a secret, kept something from you because they were thinking of themselves. I think whoever this is, um, whatever situation this is, Gemini, um, I feel like they, they may have done something that they can't take back or that's how it feels. What's with this Four of Coin? Going on with this four of coin, ace of swords, temperance. Interesting. So someone here could be wanting to have some sort of conversation. Maybe someone's kind of taking time to themselves, like. 
to calm down or balance their their emotions yeah i feel like um whoever's holding back they're probably going to want to talk about what happened i don't know if the other person would be interested in that i have the four of cups so so far what i see between this you know in this connection um, something happened in your connection in the past that um, maybe they feel like they, they want to talk about or fix. Um, but whatever it was, it was a situation where now they've put themselves in a position where it will be hard to come back. So we'll see. We'll see. Let's look at both of your energies here just to get an idea of what's going on between you. I'm going to use two decks, one for each of you, and we'll start with you, Gemini. Um, and get some oracles for you. Spirit, can I get some insight into Gemini's energy, please? In this connection, what's going on with Gemini? Now, Gemini, I'm going to have you on this side, your person on the other. But feel free to flip the energies if they resonate more. Tell me more about Gemini. Closed off. Yeah. Guarded defensive resistance. So you might be this for of coin here, Gemini. Maybe you close yourself off to protect yourself. To heal, to lick your wounds, to regroup. Tell me about this person that Gemini is dealing with. Parting ways, separation, divide, heartbreak. Yeah, something happened here. I don't think you and this person are together or perhaps there's like a divide between you, um, a distance. Spirit, tell me more about Gemini. Tell me more about Gemini. What is Gemini thinking or feeling when it comes to this person or this connection? Tell me about Gemini, please. Okay, we have the Page of Swords. This is the Vice Versa Tarot. All of the decks that I use are in the description box. We have the Emperor, yep, and the Six of Pentacles. So I feel like, Gemini, you might want to fix this or at least talk about the situation or approach what happened. Um, it's almost like you, I feel, want to see if this could be dealt with or fixed. This is this Strength, Leo energy. So we have Aries, Leo energy here. Tell me about the Six of Pentacles. Six of Cups. Maybe you feel this person is your soulmate or perhaps you have good memories when it comes to this person. Queen of Pentacles and the Fool. Yeah, I feel like some of you are willing to try again or at least talk about it. We have the King of Swords at the bottom of the deck here. Maybe you have regrets. Maybe you also had a part to play in whatever happened. Or perhaps you're willing to maybe forgive. It could also be that you're ready to start anew on your own. I don't really see that though. Can I get one for the fool, please? Ace of Cups. Can I get one more for the fool, please? Ten of Swords. Interesting. So you might be ready to, to start on your own or move on on your own here. But maybe you need closure. What's going on here for Gemini? The Ace of Wands. I feel like you're ready for something new. Now that I'm getting all these other cards about new beginnings... Yeah, I have the Five of Swords at the bottom of the deck again. Two of Pentacles, Five of Cups. I mean, I, I feel like you have regrets over what happened, or at least you wish it hadn't happened or something like that.
but maybe you're just ready to make peace with whatever happened with this person and move on with your life. I don't know. I don't know if some of you are still willing to be with this person again. I mean, let me know in the comments if that's the case. But I feel like the energy that I'm picking up here is, is of like making peace with whatever happened and moving on. Can I get some insight into this Ace of Wands? Four of Pentacles. And then the lovers at the bottom of the deck. There you are, Gemini. Knight of Cups. It could be that this person is trying to approach you to fix whatever happened or talk about whatever happened. And maybe you're just, all you're willing to do is talk about it, but you're, you're not probably willing to start again. I feel, I feel like you're holding back. You're closed off for whatever reason here. So let's look at your person. Tell me about Gemini's person. Can you tell me about Gemini's person? What are they thinking or feeling about Gemini, please? Okay, we have the Four of Swords. The Magician. Six of Pentacles. Interesting. You both have the Six of Pentacles. Tell me about the Six of Pentacles. Five of Swords. Yeah, this is about whatever happened between you. There's regrets on their side as well. Regarding the past. Five of Cups. And they also have the Emperor. <laughs> Interesting. Tell me about the Magician. What do they want to do here? What's with the Magician? Ace of Cups. Oh, wow. So, interesting. Uh, now I'm thinking that this person is the one, like, extending. Yeah. I think this person, Ace of Cups, Ace of Pentacles, I think they want, they offer you this Ace of Cups to start again. And I don't know if you're ready to do that. Maybe you are willing to try again here. But I feel like some of you are debating whether you should just end it once and for all here. Wow. Ace of Cups, Ace of Swords, Ace of Pentacles. This person is really focused on... A new beginning here with you and they want to talk about it yep and then have the three of cups eight page page of swords so this person <clears throat> I don't think they're ready to let you go and I see you considering this maybe you will actually go for this why the four of swords why the four of swords Yeah, this person's thinking about how to bring back what they've lost here, how to even out the, the scales or, or fix whatever it is that is broken. Um, Libra energy. So whatever happened, I feel like this person's really regretting it. I do see that. Me use my secret moon oracle deck here. Can I get some insight into this person that Gemini is dealing with? Can you give us some insight, Spirit, into what this person is thinking or feeling? I'm taking a risk. You are my soulmate. Okay. So they, um, they also have feelings for you and um, I feel like they're taking a risk because they don't know how you are going to feel 
about this olive branch that they're offering. It's almost like this, they probably know that there's a good chance you will not accept them. Can I get some more insight into this person? Please, Spirit. Intuitive, instinctive, and perceptive. Air sign, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. This person could also be an air sign like you, or this is, you know, they think that you are very instinctive and perceptive, very intuitive. And so, I don't know. I feel like when I see these two cards together, it's almost like they know exactly what they're dealing with with you. And I feel like that's why they're coming in with like all of these different offers here. I mean, which one? Whatever you want, I'm willing to give. So let's see. Where is um, all of this headed? What's the near future energy between you and this person? Let me just move these. What a mess. <laughs> Spirit, what is, what is next for this connection? What's next for this connection, Spirit? What's next? Oh my gosh, we have the Seven of Swords. What's next for this connection? And the Ace of Wands. Hmm. Yeah, I feel like this person um, is the Seven of Swords, your person. Because they are so adamant or so focused on this new beginning that I feel like they're, they're trying to be as strategic as possible with the Seven of Swords. I'm picturing someone very careful, like someone very, like tiptoeing around you. Can I get one more? What's next for this connection? Two of Swords. Interesting. I feel like this is you with the two of swords. You don't know what to do. Yeah, I have the lovers at the bottom of the deck, Gemini energy. You have a choice to make when this person approaches you. Thank you so much for watching, Gemini. I hope this resonated for you. Um, I hope you enjoyed the reading. If you did, please hit the like button and subscribe. Um, it really helps the channel grow and shows these people, more people, these videos. Um, and yeah, I appreciate anyone who already does that. Um, feel free to leave me a comment if you want to say hello or if this resonated for you. Um, I love hearing from my Gemini watchers. Um, the comments just are some of the best that I get. So um, yeah, I'll leave it there. Thank you so much for watching once again, and I will see you all in another video very soon. Take care.